Hello everybody, it is me again, me the movies here with another episode of my Pikmin walkthrough. Today I am doing my day three of Pikmin. Let me load my data real quick. Now we are going back to the Forest of Hope. And this time we're going to be picking up a couple items. Or uh, a couple parts. Um, I'm going to try to get um, the boss battle with the burrowing snaggerts done. I just noticed that uh, 20 yellow pellets that I need to get. Um, I'm looking to get either four to five uh, parts here. I'll see what I can do. There are a couple here that you can actually not get until uh, you have the blue Pikmin. Um, that's like, I think roughly two or three. I'm just thinking out loud here. Let me get all my Pikmin since, you know, I might as well. I don't even have a hundred yet. But that will change once I go back to the impact site. Now, let me throw 20 pigment up, or yeah, 20 yellow pigment up here, so that I can get this pellet. That should be enough. Yeah, that's enough. All right. Now I'm gonna run over here real quick, where I defeated that really big bulborb, take out the spy bulborbs, and then I'm going to get that Nova Blaster. You better not eat my pigment, yo. See, like I said before, if um, if a, if a Bulborb, you know, a Dwarf Bulborb, has uh, one of your Pikmin in its mouth, you do not have to worry. If you can kill him before he eats it, you will be good. So now that I've got the Noble Blaster, I'm going to uh, use these remaining yellow Pikmin, get some of these bombs, and I'm gonna open up the remainder of the walls that I didn't get. And it's actually not that much. Uh, I think just uh, the wall with the extraordinary bolt behind it, that should be it. Alright, use my remaining Pikmin that I have that are not carrying bombs. We'll get that Dwarf Bulborb. And I'm going to go open that wall. And yeah, that should be good. Uh, I just got to worry about uh, uh, these little snitch... No, not, they're not snitch bugs. I forget what they're called. But... Uh, I need all of these bombs. I need all the bombs I can get right now. So we shall see if I can't get these guys. It'd actually probably be safer if I uh, fought them with Olimar. You know, just just Olimar. But we'll see. We'll see. I think I got a whole lot of them. Maybe. Maybe. No. No, I don't think so. All right. Attack my Pikmin. Attack. Ah, oh, he got one. No, bro. You piece of crap! I hit you! Oh man. Uh, if you guys don't know, the uh, the pale-looking ones will not hurt you. Those are actually the female. But the purple ones, those are the males, and they will in fact kill your Pikmin. So be careful, yo. Alright, I got four bombs on that. Oh crap. Ah, that was sketchy. That was really sketchy. Just saying. Alright, let's see. One more bomb. Shall do it. And huzzah. That wall is down. Now I can get the extraordinary bolt. And I will be good. Now it looks as though I actually have 100 Pikmin. And this is this is the way I like making Pikmin. Uh, like if I have 100 Pikmin in the field, and he just told you that if you have 100 Pikmin in the field, the other Pikmin get born, but they get born inside the onions, so you don't have to pick them out of the ground. The only flaw in that is that they do not absorb nutrients from being you know in the ground. But uh, it also makes Pikmin much easier to make. Um, the, yeah, like the only drawback is they're always going to be Leaf Pikmin, so can't really fix that. Now let me kill those. Extraordinary Bolt, here we come. And that'll be my second part of the day. It looks like I can only put 50, and that's alright. Let me pick up some of these carcasses. Oh crap, I always hate that. You know, you're throwing one Pikmin on, and you mean to put it on another, and then he just goes ahead and does whatever. Whatever, whatever. Alright, now, while they are... Oh, I have bomb. I have bombs. Interesting. 
Um, while they are taking the extraordinary bolt, I'm going to co these bulb orbs with some bomb attacks. We'll see what I can do. I got eight. That's way more than enough. And now the extraordinary bolt has reached my ship. And I'm guessing you should know what the extraordinary bolt does. It's a bolt that's extraordinary. Just so you know. Just saying. Alright, what just happened now is that I just now unlocked the Forest Naval. And I will be going there next. In my next uh, next video. Alright, that's... That's one bomb. Oh crap, I woke up both of them. That's no good. That's bad. Crap, yo. Oh, he killed one! And there goes another one. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, well, this one, this, this, this bomb will do it. Ah, uh, you're kidding me! All right, now, yeah, good. Now he's dead. Good. All right, those shall trouble me no longer. I shall go back and get the rest of my Pikmin. That was weird. Um. I'm going to... Yeah, like I said before, I'm going to be fighting the uh, those Burrowing Snagrits. I don't know why I'm bringing my Pikmin along. Uh, I just need to get the rest of my Pikmin so that this boss fight shall be easy. I'm going to get... that. I mean, the Geiger counter is the part that the Burrowing Snagrits have. You only actually... There's three Burrowing Snagrits, and you only actually need to defeat one. Um... But usually, you can't escape the fight with the uh, first one, so we'll see, we'll see. Dun dun, dun dun. Alright, and this, uh, some people may think that to get to the Burrowing Snaggers you need the Blue Pikmin, and that is actually not the case, because I found out that, uh, you know, there's this box that's in the way, like in the uh, impact site. Um, and it looks as though the only way to get past it is with uh, blue Pikmin to get on the side. But I figured out that yellow Pikmin can actually bypass the box if you uh, run with them. And that is what I'm going to do. And if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, I will show you right now. So you just grab one, run forward, and uh, yeah, you just let go once you get around somewhere. Um, for some reason, the Pikmin like just give up. Um, just they just like give up, like walking up to the box. They'll just stop. I don't know why. But yeah, you just keep repeating this. Uh, you you want to be careful not to throw them in the water because uh, usually you won't be able to get them out of the water because it's so far. Just be wary. Be wary. I'm actually lucky that yellow Pikmin in the background you saw there. I'm actually lucky that didn't trigger. Um, one of the burrowing snaggers to come out of the ground. Um, something else you guys want to be careful about is crossing this tiny narrow bridge. What I do is I just uh, gonna get all my Pikmin. What I do is I just swirl them around so that they get all bundled up. Oh, I just lost one. Uh, shall I, can I save it? Come on, Pikmin. Yes, I did save it. And he got stuck in the water again because he's a retard. But I just, bun I just bundle up the Pikmin and then rush across, and that usually works. All right, yeah. See, you can never get past this this Snagrit for some reason. See, he's just there. All right, the uh, you usually can't not. You usually are gonna lose Pikmin in this fight. I've never found a way around it. Um, but you just gotta keep uh, keep attacking. You you do more damage to the Snagrit if you get Pikmin on their face. Just keep throwing Pikmin on its face, and eventually they will die. Uh, and something else about Snagrits is event uh, sometimes when they come out of the ground, um, they get stuck, and so that is your cue to start laying waste to their face. Lay waste to their face. See, I don't think this one was the one with the uh, the part. No, it was not. So this, it'll, yeah, it'll be right there. There you go. Right, I'm going to lay waste to your face, my friend. Eat it. Eat this pain. 
Yeah, it doesn't taste good, does it? That's why I don't buy it. Pain is bad. For you, anyway. See? So look at all that damage. Look at that damage. Oh, he's got like a tiny sliver of health yet. Health left. Gotta be like that. He got stuck in the ground a couple of times. That's actually pretty good. Pretty stinking good. Alright, I got 41. That should be way more than enough to get this Geiger counter over here. Let's... Yeah, it should take like 15. 15? Yeah, 15. Alright. Okay. And something else... I'm gonna get one more part today. I should be able to. Um, it's another place. I think... I think it looks like you have to have blue Pikmin. I'm not too sure. Um, hopefully they don't trigger that other Snaggert to come out. Gotta be careful. Sometimes the Snaggerts can like show up out of nowhere and start eating your Pikmin. Gotta be careful. Um, one thing you could do is when you're fighting the Snaggerts, if you already have the blue Pikmin, let them carry the Geiger counter and they'll go. They'll just walk into the water. But you also gotta make sure that none of the uh, got. You gotta make sure there's no other colored Pikmin because the blue Pikmin will take it into the water and drown your other Pikmin. So you gotta be careful. All right. This part is guarded only by a Bulborb, and he's asleep. So I'm gonna use my bombs and finish him off. Uh, I think it's the Gravity Jumper. Is that the Gravity Jumper? I forget uh, the names. Some, there, sometimes there's really weird names. Oh, you're kidding me. Stop going for that. Come on. Oh, whatever. I give up. You can take this stupid thing. You can have it. Alright, that is what I'm going to get. Make sure not to wake him up. Make sure not to drop those bombs. Two bombs will finish him off. And this time, since there's not two Bulborbs, uh, hopefully this won't uh, absolutely screw up like it did last time. Right, there's one. And two. And he has been defeated. It did. Defeation. Defeation. Alright. No, Shock Absorber, that's what it is. Alright, I thought this took 40, but it only takes 30. Luckily, 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 I could have sworn that that took 40, and I was about to freak out. Alright, they're just now getting that Geiger counter. And since I lost Pikmin, I got my uh, 100 down to like, I don't know, 91. Or no, it was about 80. So that caused Pikmin to start getting born outside the well, outside the onion. But 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 you can actually counter that uh, if you have Pikmin in reserve, you can get Pikmin out to get to 100, and the Pikmin will start getting uh, born back inside the onions. So you know, just 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 try to make Pikmin as fast as you can. That's all I'm saying. Alright, the Geiger, Geiger counter is now on the ship. That little radar thing. And now the shock absorber is coming up next. Right behind it. Yeah, see now I got a hundred, so Pikmin will now start being born inside the onions, and that will save me some time. I don't think that shows up on the ship. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Shock Absorber, and that will finish off my day. Make sure I'm not missing any Pikmin. It looks like I am. Alright, I don't remember leaving these guys, but whatever. Ooh! Sap! Sap! You can knock those guys down, you'll get some sap. Oh, no, no, no! No! Fudge! Fudge crackers, man. What? Oh. See, that is how fast. That is a testament to how fast Pikmin can screw you. I, oh, bro. See, once they keep, uh, once they drink sap, they have a tiny sliver of uh, time in which they're immobile. And I called my bomb Pikmin back, and that bomb went off, and the Pikmin couldn't move out of the way. There was no way. For me to save them. That was my bad. One bomb, and my Pikmin took that major hit. 
That absolutely freaking sucks. Uh, I'll see the loss on. Uh, I'll see the loss after this cutscene. Let's see how bad it was. At least I didn't leave any pigment behind, and I got a whole lot of uh, parts. So let's see the damage. Ah, uh, seventy. Ah, oh, that's that sucks. That absolutely sucks. Oh well. All right, now that I'm locked the forest naval, I'm going to be getting the blue pigment, knocking down as many walls as possible. See if I can't kill that bread bug. Um. Um, 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 um. Yeah, let's try and kill that mushroom man as well. And if you guys like my videos, give me a like, comment, or subscribe. I would definitely appreciate it. And I will see you guys in my next episode. See you then.